So today I'm going to be showcasing what's on my iPhone 16 Pro. Of course, this is with Apple Intelligence, the latest and greatest iOS update. And I'm going to show you guys my home screen setup, my wallpaper, my control center, everything. So make sure you guys subscribe, drop a like on this video and comment down below what iPhone do you have. And before we even get into it, quick word from my sponsor. Today's video is sponsored by Soundcore, introducing their brand new C40i open earbuds. For some people, in-ear earbuds feel tight and uncomfortable. Sometimes they even slip out your ears during workouts and can even block safety alerts when outdoors, making it difficult to be aware of your surroundings. And that is where Soundcore C40i comes into play. Thanks to its open ear clip-on design, elevated for all day wear comfort, and is built for all ears, big or small, Flexible joints offer more stabilities. These are not flying off my ears, not one bit. Now, if the fit feels a bit loose, you can use the attachable ear grips to assure the best fit for your ears. You have an accident-free intuitive buttons for control, and the sound quality is pretty good thanks to its extensive drivers. And of course, you can control the EQ, enable 3D sound, customize the control for each earbud, and as well as dual connections, which is gonna allow you to connect another device, all within the Soundcore app. So I highly recommend the Soundcore C40i. It's comfortable, it has a flexible fit, and has an amazing sound quality. I'll throw a link in the description. Thank you so much, Soundcore, for sponsoring this video. Today is Halloween, so yes, you guys are watching this video very, very soon. <laughs> like literally another two hours, you guys are gonna see this video, but this is my lock screen setup, and here's how my control center is looking like, so I can see what's now playing. So Big Sean, Bryson Tiller, that's playing right now. Well, let's pause. And of course, I have my toggles, my Wi-Fi, my AirDrop, my mute switch, my orientation lock. Everything is nice and neat. And of course, I have my lights here, so you guys can see the lights are being controlled in the background, and as well as my bed light. I have a bunch of smart home tech in my room. Of course, my focus, you guys know these toggles already. And you guys can see, also, I do have my TV remote here, just in case if I can't find my remote, I have it present here. And I just wanted to show you guys that. But anyway, here's my home screen setup. So you guys can see here, right on the top, we have a motivational quote of the day. Don't confuse my personality with my attitude. My personality is who I am and my attitude depends on who you are. So this, the motivational app gets me every single time. And as soon as you unlock your phone, I always see some very powerful quotes. Sometimes I even use it on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram, by the way, at Simply Pops. And yeah, I, I love the motivation quote. Just a great way to uh, unlock your iPhone too. And on the bottom left, we have the boring weather. I think this is the best weather client for the iPhone. I could tap on it. You guys can see, I could play around with the effects and you can see the, um, the forecast on the bottom. And actually it's a beautiful day out. 80 degrees on Halloween and NYC, that's, that's perfect. Could be even too hot for some, but amazing weather outside at 68 degrees. Next to that, I have my ND clock, so you could be able to have a nice visualization on the time. And yes, I have it on the status bar, but I like the fact how it shows the date and the, um, the time nice and big and right there in the center, basically. And then underneath that, I have all of my most used apps here. So YouTube Music, TikTok, Amazon, Safari, YouTube, of course, X, follow me on X as Simply Pops. Like all the apps that you guys know and love, I use pretty much at a daily basis. Um, I'm always shopping on Amazon. I'm always on X on Twitter. As you guys can see here, let me just pull up my profile. Here it is, the same exact wallpaper on the top. It's just beautiful. Uh, just a little teaser of my wallpaper pack, which is coming soon. And messages, I gotta check my messages, 246 unread messages. And then next to that, I have Instagram. Follow me on Instagram at Simply Pops. You guys can see Young Thug is officially free and coming home today. I'm seeing that all over X. And yeah, like yet again, just follow me. It's a bunch of goodness there. And then, okay, next page, we have the Notion calendar. So these are all the upcoming events. I actually supposed to be at an event today, but driving to New York City, Manhattan is a pain in the neck and I hate taking transportation. So that's the reason why I'm home right now making this video. And tomorrow, we just have up and coming events. It's hard to believe that daylight saving time ends on Sunday. 
Let me know down in the comments down below, do you like this time where it gets dark quick or do you like daylight savings where it gets uh, dark late? So let me know in the comments. Me personally, I love daylight savings time, but I hate the time change because the day is gonna feel, well, actually the day is gonna feel longer because we're going back in time. But anyway, it's just up and coming events. And this is thanks to Notion Calendar. And speaking of calendar, I have the calendar. Next to that, I have Club Life. This is my access to the gym. So I launched this app and it, it's presented with a QR code. I scan that QR code, I'm in the gym. And I also have YT Studio. This is to check my analytics, my YouTube comments, see what's going on with you guys on YouTube. And then I have a folder dedicated for traveling. So I have JetBlue, which is an airline, Priority Pass, those are for the airport lounges. I have the Delta app, I have my TSA, which is an absolute stable. You see how long those TSA lines, it give you an estimate on how long you're gonna wait. And you have your imagery edge. So anytime I'm taking pictures while I'm out on the go, I can be able to just launch up that app. And I have my aroma plan, that is for my diffuser, which I have right there in the background. It's Bluetooth, so anywhere I go, I can be able to turn that on and have a nice aroma therapy. And I have Uber, of course, that's public transportation there. So yeah, that's the travel folder. I have my settings, of course. I have my camera. And thanks to Apple Intelligence, I can start to remove elements on this picture, such as the leaves. So. Uh, you guys see that? I already made an entire video on this. That could work for any photo. It doesn't have to be iPhone photos. It could be uh, anything from a DSLR camera or from your iPhone, somebody else's iPhone. You could use cleanup uh, pretty much on any photo. Next to that, I have my Notion. So this is for uh, securing business meeting, coming up with YouTube ideas. Yeah, so as you guys can see, I have all my, uh, my ideas here, my B-roll list, my shorts list. Everything is presented here, so um, that's how I get my business done. As soon as I wake up, I always launch up my Notion to see what can I do for today. It's kind of, and last but not least, we have the Photos app, which I was just there. And as you guys can see, I'm a very simple guy. I have a very simple setup. I don't have no app on the dock just because I don't need anything because everything is already presented here. So I really don't, I don't need to have any apps and it looks a lot more cleaner. I just wish you could hide the dock background so you can see more of your wallpaper. And of course, I do have some stacks, but some stacks are similar to others. So I have the weather presented here on the front page, and that is it. And then if I go into the Notion calendar, I can be able to control my lights yet again, but I can control everything with Control Center. And then I have my Apple Mail, which I've been using a lot of, just thanks to Apple Intelligence. Yeah, it's a lot going on outside. I'm making this video real quick. But um, but yeah, that's basically it. That's all I have on my iPhone. And of course I have my app library if I don't have, if I can't find anything. And of course I have the spotlight, which I can just tap and be able to present with my spotlight if I'm looking for an app. And that's basically it. Um, I'm a very simple guy, very simple guy. Just two pages. Some guys will, we got some people walking around with five pages. It's just unnecessary to me. Um, all I do on my iPhone, I take pictures, I go on social media and repeat. Oh, and listen to music. Listen to music, take pictures, social media. That's it. That's all I do. I don't play games, none of that stuff. So